Hello world, it's Angelot. Um, I'm going to show you the latest development in my OpenCL particle systems. I got about 20 million particles going in real time on the Fermi card, the, the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 480. So I got to run a video I took with record my desktop on Ubuntu, which is what we're running on that machine. So check it out. All right, here I'm starting off just running a million particles. And this is the OpenCL file. So I build it, I run it. You can see we got about 500 frames a second. Those are average timings, so it's constantly being updated. Now let's change it to 10 million. Let's see what happens. Alright, a little bit slower now. Yeah, the record of my desktop is also not really keeping up with what's going on. This is really snappy. I'm just playing with it. So these are the Lorenz attractors. I just start um, all 10 million are distributed along a circle that you see there and um, then they follow the paths of the equation. I'm using a Runga cut of 4 solver so I'll change the time step in the next example but this is that was 20 million now I can change the parameter. We'll run it again. Oh yeah, I can increase the time step here. Make it go faster. Oh, the particles move faster. The frame rate's still around 40. I actually quit this example too soon. Oh, and uh record my desktop and also pick up there. So now I go back to 10 million and I, I show what it looks like with alpha blending. I'll switch it on here. That taxes the rendering a good bit and it makes uh, 20 million unusable. You'll see the frame rate here is about 20, um, but you get some pretty neat effects. So this actually does work from my Blender uh, repo on GitHub, but doing more than 100,000 vertices in a mesh chokes blender up so well hope you enjoyed